I think when athletes see the Broken Skull Challenge on TV, they're attracted to it and they want to come out here because they truly love a challenge and they can see that this is the real authentic deal. There ain't no BS, there ain't nothing shiny about it, there ain't no soap opera, and you are either effective and you go on or you're ineffective and you go home. There's been a couple of instances when I've been sad to see competitors leave. Hell, we had a girl uh, on the Nutcracker, and she was from a state that has a lot cooler temperature than we have out here in the desert in California. And that heat got to her, she was frustrated, and she just toppled over. We had to bring in the medics. When I run this show, I am impartial. I have no favorites. I treat everybody the exact same. Holy! Nicely done, nicely done. Way oh, we got a winner. Yeah! When you come back, you stick around. Through those rounds, I get to know you a little bit better. You know, when Ian came out here and set the legend, Tommy Hackenbrook home. Hell yeah! And Tommy represented out here, he had $70,000 of my money. And I was used to him, he comes from a football background, coached by Urban Meyer, a class act. When you get a chance to know guys like that, know guys like Ian and they get sent home, yeah, it's kind of sad. Steve Austin, Broken Skull Challenge. New episode Sunday, November 13th at 10, 9 central.